Hey, it's Nikki. Um, so I just went through a breakup a few days ago, and uh, I decided I'm done with the whole conventional dating stuff. Like, this is a new age. There are new ways to do things. I thought I was happy, but there, that's there isn't just one way to be happy. And, Especially when you're relying on another person. That's not a guaranteed outcome of happiness. This is just depending on them. So I've decided to start dating myself. And I think this is a really good decision. I'm only a day into it since I've decided that's what I'm going to do. But... It's been quite the ride. I, I leave little notes all over the place for myself, and some of them are really innocent, like, hey, you're beautiful. You're gonna rock your quiz tomorrow. <laughs> but then some can be like a little dirtier, <laughs> which like, spices things up in the relationship. Um, and then you, you just have to forget what you wrote. That's really the only way that you'll be surprised each time but it's fun you should try it um and the other way you can date yourself is when you go out in public you hold your other hand and normally I wouldn't promote the uh nonconformism that I follow but holding your own hands that's showing that you are content with yourself you are happy with yourself you're getting your love from yourself. Um, you don't have to hold it in a super awkward way. There are multiple places you can put it. Hold your hand up here. You can hold it just like over your breast. This one's really good because it shows the comfort that you're getting from yourself. Um, you can wrap around. Actually, no, you you can't actually hold your hands that way. Um, yeah. But it's just symbolic for you, it's symbolic for everyone else. And I am just screw traditional dating, like date yourself, you'll be so much happier that way. <laughs> I promise.